Here is the first fit. It's just a leather jacket with a striped shirt, some American Eagle jeans, some boots, and then I'm going, obviously I kind of curled my hair a little bit, but like it's falling out a little, so it's fine. But I'm going to wear this like little sweater when I go to the bookstore for a photo. So yeah, super excited, but let's go pick up my sister. Well, fall hello guys so i am back obviously luna wants to say hey 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 baba we did a lot today we did a lot did some shopping we ate at some good restaurants the drive was honestly not that bad there's very little traffic it wasn't hectic i was not stressed at all like me and my sister did not fight one time you guys know our sisters are you bicker you, you scream at each other for a second and you're fine we did not have any tense moment like at all and it was like what's going on it was super nice and fun and then the first thing we did was went to the museum the museum was beautiful like there was a legit Pablo Picasso art right there and I was just like that's Pablo Picasso you know what I'm saying like I was like shunned like I was shocked and then um they had Andy Warhol stuff in there like you could flip through his book I was again amazed it was so beautiful um, so I loved that and the lady there was super nice and gave us a few pamphlets and stuff and then we um, went to the bookstore it's called pretty good books super cute super um, chill I don't know I liked it it was really beautiful Luna Luna mommy trying to film <laughs> didn't bring anything for you I'm sorry I thought about you though, but like they didn't have anything you'd want in TJ Maxx. But then we, what are you doing? Lay your booty down. But yeah, we went to the bookstore. It was really cute. I was living my Beauty and the Beast dreams. Thank you, Luna. Okay, don't get your booty out the face. But um, yeah, it was super nice and chill. He's distracting me. Um, so yeah, had fun there. But I can't do that. You're gonna put me out of focus, Bubba. So yeah, we did that and then we drove around. We went to this really cool park. Um, we loved the park. We went to the bookstore, it was nice. And then after, I think I already said that. Um, then we went downtown. Um, like to like, or it's not really downtown, but like the whole place like was really like everything we went to in the downtown area. They had these beautiful churches and the architecture was so cute. I wish I could have got some pictures, but obviously I was sadly the one driving. So we did that for a little bit and then we drove to this really cute park. Like I said, it was beautiful. Loved it. Um, yeah, they had a really cool AMC theater. I thought it was amazing. It was just really old school and like cute. And I just think the architecture there is really beautiful. A lot of the stuff they had downtown. Is that right? Then we went to the little mall. They had like a cute little small mall. It was very small, like maybe a couple, like maybe five or six 
shopping stores. Like they had like a Rue 21 and Claire's. They had like a Hibbit Sports. That was about it, honestly. Um, they had a TG Max in there, so I'm gonna show you what I got from there. That right. So yeah, and then we just kind of went and ate at this really cool place called Brick House Grill. I would recommend that to anyone. The service there was amazing. It was beautiful, and this is so weird, but like the bathrooms were so clean and nice, and I can appreciate a good clean bathroom, you guys. Um, yeah, like it had a door on it, so the door went all the way down to the floor, so there's no holes, no gaps, which I appreciate. And it was just so beautiful, like the whole place was beautiful. I got chicken tacos, 10 out of 10, love my chicken tacos. And it only cost me and my sister 34 bucks to eat there for both our meals, which was nice. I got me some books to read because I'm kind of in my book era of my life and I'm trying to learn to love to read. So I got some books and I can't wait to actually read them and yeah. See, I got a lot of books actually. I did not realize how many I got. So I got this book called Radiance. It's about a girl who um, dies and she has a mission in order to get to the afterlife or something. So she has to go back home. It's kind of like one of the Hallmark movies. Then I got this book. It was only a dollar. It was like one of the ones that was on sale. It says, "Caught it isn't easy, uh, it isn't easy being able to remind and it's like vibes and stuff. So, um, yeah, we're just gonna, I don't really know what that's about. Then we have this one by Tori Spelling. I don't know where I know her from, but I know her from somewhere. She's some actress and it's a book on just fame and stuff and her story. So I thought that'd be interesting, a little different. This one, Slow Hands, it's about like women and stuff and, um, yeah. Um, so yeah, I don't really know. It's a bunch of women's stories about like being the one to make the first move and things like that. And then next, I got this one, The Point of Return. I'm super excited about. I heard this is a really good book. So I'm super excited about this one. So yeah, then The Geography of Bliss. It's about traveling and stuff. So I just, I thought I liked that. And then lastly, this book right here is, um, it's Little Woman. I hear good things about Little Woman. So one, the cover is like fucking beautiful. Um, but yeah, it's called, yeah, this was like the most expensive book, which was only $9.97. I highly recommend pretty good books. Like, it was amazing and beautiful. So yeah. Ready? So then I went to Bath and Body Works, and they had like their little sale, so I got a bunch of hand soaps. Super excited about to have some in the bathroom. Um, so I'm super excited to have some hand soaps in there. And I also got this bar soap, because I like to use bar soap to scrub my body first, and then I go in with the smell good stuff, so I got that then i went to tj maxx and it's so random but i got a paris puzzle because i've always wanted to go to paris it was only six bucks so why should i be missing a piece if we we're missing a piece i'd cry but um yeah i got this and i'm ready to do this because i'm excited because i love paris and it's my dream to go to paris so yeah fun fact and then lastly i saw this in the checkout and i had to get it and we're going to try it together i've never had macaroons before it's like a la like new york thing i think um so we don't really have any places like this down in the south so i saw it and i was excited so i'm super excited this is the they had a strawberry one or salted caramel i like salted caramel so yeah i'm super excited never had them before so i'm gonna try it and see if it's good Ooh. smell like salted caramel okay i figured this would be soft it's hard so it's like basically like cookie The flavor is really good. I kind of get the hype of it because when you bite into it, it's super soft and like crumbly and like moist on the inside. It's hard on the outside, so you wouldn't expect that. That's really good, guys. Hmm. Highly recommend these macaroons that were $4.99 at TJ Maxx. I'm gonna have to go to Orchard Day Max and see if we have any. Hmm. I like them. So that's my haul. And that is pretty much 24 hours in LaGrange. That's what we did today. It was super fun. And yeah, I loved it. So, yeah. <laughs>